I'm Richard Scott Traver, sales manager for the ESL Emergency Power Solutions Group. And today we want to talk about our newest product, the Ready Connect ATS with cams. This new product opens up a whole new avenue for you to consider when providing backup power to your facility. This ATS comes with all the standard features that all other ESL product lines come with, as well as a number of features that are incorporated into the ATS itself. This unit can be used where you want to bring in a portable generator before or during an incident or when your permanent generator is going to go offline and if you lose power during that time it will automatically switch over the portable generator to back up the facility. It operates very much like a manual transfer switch in that you have a hinged flap door here at the bottom where your portable generators would come in to connect up to the cams. This hinge flap is held down by the retainer on the door when the system is not in use. As we mentioned earlier, a number of options are available, such as a heater with a dehumidistat and a thermostat. The unit comes with aux contacts as standard on the ATS and it comes with an auto start function where you can connect your auto start for the portable generator, thus making the unit NEC 703F compliant right out of the factory. The ATS can be purchased in two different versions. There's the standard open transition ATS, as well as a delayed transition ATS. Either is available. It can be two, three, or four poles, and it has a function so that you can make it a manual transfer switch as well. In addition, the ATS has a number of built-in functions that you can utilize with the unit. Included is a phase rotation monitor, so you can make sure that the portable generator is in the correct phase. It has a frequency monitor, and it has an under or over voltage monitor, all incorporated into the ATS. The Ready Connect ATS with cams, utilized in applications where a portable generator then can be automatically started upon the loss of power.